How many times did you walk out of your house wearing a sweater and just hours into the morning, you're already way too hot? Maybe you're looking at your closet and you're thinking, what do I wear? It's maybe spring, it's kind of winter. Well, today I'm going to be sharing with you five tips on how to transition your winter wardrobe into a spring wardrobe. So you haven't quite had the time to do a huge closet overhaul, right? Bringing in some of your all your spring items or your summer items, and plus the weather's kind of fickle right now. So what do you do? Layer. So tip number one is layering. So you can layer with jackets, you can layer with long sleeve shirts, you can layer with scarves, and one of my favorites is with these shrubs because you can they're warm enough in the morning, and then in the afternoon you could take it off, and then you're wearing something light underneath. Couple more examples of layering pieces. Here you have this nice infinity scarf that you could also layer with and it also makes like a really cute shrug. Also some vests and you can belt them just to keep yourself a little bit more warm. And then also you can go with like a leather jacket but in a different color so that um, it says spring a little bit more. A couple more options. Kimonos are really trending for spring so that's a, also a great way to show a little bit of spring trend and wear it over maybe a long sleeve shirt or a turtleneck. Here's another example of a kimono that you could also wear with pants or um, boots or then later on you can transition um, and wear them with shorts and skirts or dresses. And then of course you could have like a like a utilitarian short jacket um, that's springish but still keeps you warm. Nothing says spring more than a pop of color. So bringing in a fresh green under your layers or a pop of peachy pink under your layers or you could even bring in color with your layers such as this trench coat and bringing it in in a pale pink. This is definitely a great way to stay warm but still say spring is coming. What's really trending for spring are bright colors and pastels. So bright pop of red, mustard, greens, blues and in pastels this pink. Another easy way to transition your outfit from winter to spring and refreshing it is with new prints. So prints that you could probably already find in your closet are nautical stripes, like this t-shirt, or polka dots. These are classic staples season after season for every spring. I showed you a couple of print t-shirts, but here's some blouses as well. So you could bring in a polka dot blouse. Maybe this is something a little bit more dressed up for work, or you could bring in some florals. If you need to take it up a notch, you could throw on a blazer over the polka dots uh, with the floral jacket. If that's a little bit too daytime, you could also pair it with darker jeans or some slacks. And it's, again, just a nice way to bring in a little bit of a uh, spring kind of trend into your more like trans transitional win winter uh, closet. And a couple more examples here with stripes. Also stripes are very casual, but you can pair some stripes up with slacks and just dress it up um, to make it a little bit more work appropriate. So next, let's talk about shoes. It's probably too soon for flip-flops, but it's too warm for tall boots. So I have the perfect solution, mules. These are awesome because you don't even have to be pedicure ready. They cover up your toes nicely. A couple examples of the mule shoes. So again, you could wear um, a long sleeve shirt or top with like maybe a skirt and your mules. Again, it's kind of more of like that um, spring, spring like look. Or if you're going to be wearing pants, you could also wear them too. So it's not as it's not as hot uh, wearing boots or 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 even booties for that for that matter. And one of the easiest way to transition your wardrobe any season, especially from winter to spring, is with new accessories. They help to refresh and reinvent and restyle your outfits. So bringing in necklaces or scarves and belts. And with a belt, you can just start tucking in one of your blouses into your favorite trousers or jeans or skirts and just really kind of refresh, reinvent those looks. Here's an example of a scarf. So again, you could be wearing a sweater, but maybe bringing in a floral print scarf to tie around your neck, or maybe a floral belt to wear with a t-shirt or a long sleeve shirt. A couple more belted looks. You could uh, wear a black pencil skirt and then belt it either through loops or just when you, when you tuck in so you can cover up the seam line there, or you could tuck in a blouse into your 
into your trousers. Again, spring is a little bit lighter, so you're not wearing as many bulky sweaters. So this is a perfect opportunity to bring in um, belts and also refresh your, your wardrobe. So now you've learned five different ways to transition your wardrobe from winter to spring. And now I wanna hear from you. Let me know what is one of your favorite ways to transition your wardrobe or what you learned in this video. And if you like this video, be sure to like it and share it with a friend. And if you're dreading the change of the season and having to adjust your entire wardrobe for the weather, I've got good news for you. I have a free style workshop teaching you how to create your capsule collection. With a capsule collection, you shop your closet and you choose your 20 favorite and most essential items that fit you and flatter you. So every time you open up your closet, everything in there is ready to go outfits and you're able to get ready in less than five minutes. That sounds awesome. Click the link below and make sure you reserve your seat. Thanks for watching.